Hello makers and welcome back! In today's project we are going to make together a really simple natural deodorant. This recipe is really easy because it doesn't even involve any melting. All you need to do is combine 5 ingredients together and it's really easy, just like baking a super easy cake. This deodorant contains a mix of oils and butters to keep our skin moisturized and irritation free and powders to keep us sweat-free and odor-free. Make sure to read through each ingredient profile in the text down below, where I go into details about the properties of each ingredient. If you prefer, you can also listen to the audio version, explain the ingredient's properties. All you need for this recipe is a bowl and a tablespoon. I have provided measures in spoons, but if you want to be very precise, I highly recommend to weigh your ingredients using a high precision scale. The first step is to mix the arrowroot powder or the cornstarch and the baking soda or the other powder of your choice, such as magnesium hydroxide or zinc oxide, inside your bowl. Once you've done this, add the shea butter and the coconut oil to the same bowl and start mixing everything together until there are no clumps left. Depending on the temperature you live in, you might need to apply a bit of pressure and use just a little bit of elbow grease to ensure that all of the ingredients get combined together. Once you've obtained a really soft, clumps-free butter, it's time to give your deodorant the scent of your dreams. Add the essential oils of your choice and mix well to incorporate them evenly. It's time to spoon the deodorant into a tin or a jar. I recommend to use a wide mouth container so you can apply the deodorant with ease. You don't need to store the deodorant in the fridge and it will last you for at least six months unless you finish it earlier. I really hope you will enjoy making this recipe as much as I always do. I think my body has completely adapted to natural deodorants and I'm so happy that I've finally settled with this recipe. What's your experience with using natural deodorants? I cannot wait to see your beautiful creations. Until then, I will see you in the next project.